A trip to Mombasa wouldn't be complete without its world's cultural site. In this video, I'll be showing you top things to do while in hotels. So enjoy the intro and let's get straight into the video. Guys, look at how narrow this alleyway is. It's so, so narrow. Damn. So this town has been in existence for like 500 years and you can tell by like the presence once you are here. The narrow streets, yeah, it actually like takes you back in time. Yeah. So guys, this is the first White House in Kenya. What? There? 1520. 1520. Yeah. What? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and now it's it's your shop. Yeah, you sell. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now nice. when you come with the family, yeah, they can find you. You can find the building too. Yeah, the see. building is still here. Yeah, wow. And and the proceeds from here you used to maintain the building. Yes. Wow, wow, wow. That is that is so amazing. What? Wow. Pick up just to promote the building. Yes, yes. And guys, when well, once you are around Old Town, you need to visit this place. Yeah, this is just yeah. for maybe for you. Oh you wow! The White House. It's very cheap. Yeah. Yes. You know how much? How much? You just give me fifteen. One fifty. One fifty. Oh, one fifty. Yes. What's your name again? My name Simon. Simon. So when guys are in Old Town, they should look for Simon over here at the White House. Yeah, they come straight to White House. Come straight to White House. Yes. Yes. Wow. Well, so thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. What are you doing? Are you a journalist? Or? I'm a I'm a vlogger. Yeah, this is uh, for YouTube. It's going to be on YouTube. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, true. So 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 so. Let me. I'll take this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, and uh, thank you so much. So guys, I got this band from that guy. Whenever you're in the old town, you know we need to promote local businesses. So yeah guys, when you're around, make sure you hit him up, go check out uh, White House over here in Old Town. And yeah, we need to promote our uh, local businesses. So right now, let's go to Fort Jesus. Yeah, we we'll go see what's up over there. But while you're in Old Town... Yeah, when you're in Old Town, make sure there's a lot of art shops around. So make sure you just uh, get something, you know? Yeah, as you can see behind me, there are also some more. So yeah, make sure you pass by one. Like the one I just went to for that guy in White House. Beautiful place, he's a good guy. So yeah, man, let's... Yeah, let's go. Oh, Abu Dhamfrit is going to be my tour guide for the rest of the day. Yeah, and so what, when guys come to Port Jesus, they should look for you. Yeah. Yeah, they should, you should look for him. I'll put his number yeah. in the description of the video so that guys can... They just call you once they know town. And they came to visit. Yeah, they come to visit, you show them around. Yeah. Guys, the symbol of Old Town is this coffee pot. Wow. That's fascinating. I didn't know about that. And for Mombasa is the elephant task. So guys, we are in Fort Jesus. It's a national monument. And it's protected by UNESCO. It's protected by UNESCO. It's a world heritage site. It's a world heritage site. Wow. There it is. So guys, we're currently at the entrance of Fort Jesus. So yeah, let's go inside and see what this place is all about. Let's go. So yeah, that's the entrance. We've gotten the tickets. So yeah, let's proceed. The ticket will get us stamped there. Yeah, and the tickets are only two dollars for adults. Let me show you guys the the rates. Kenyans two hundred, kids one hundred. Yeah, foreigners one thousand two hundred. Yep. 
Okay, so this is the history of the Fort Jesus. Whoa. 1593 is when it was built, right? Yeah. 1598, the Roman Arab conquered the fort. Okay. 1885, the British came and conquered the fort. Wow. Come Getting the ticket stamped. And Fort Jesus is so beautiful. It has a whole garden inside. Wow, this is inside Fort Jesus. I never expected this. This is the model, guys, of the fort on how it is. Okay? Oh, yeah, this is like an aerial view. Now we enter through here. Oh, yeah. The natural coral, huh? yeah. yeah. So the coral is under the sea. It's a, yeah, it's under the sea. So millions ago, the sea it was all the way. Oh, okay. This is water moved. So the Portuguese they found the huge coral and then they used African to chisel. So oh, yeah, to chisel the coral. Yeah, to chisel the coral. Yeah, and make years, and, and and make this whole place yeah. like this. Three years, but there were four thousand people. Okay. They used to pay African food only. And okay. if you look at this side, you can see. It's called Passage of the Arches. The okay. Passage of the Arches, you can see the entrance down there. That's why the Portuguese they used to bring their weapons from the ocean. Oh, all right. So when they bring their weapons... It comes is, up like this. No, there is the cave where yeah. they used to keep their weapons. It's called ammunition store. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, guys, this is a cave. Yeah. It used to be the ammunition store. Yeah. What? After that, the cave. After the slave trade was started, okay. this is where they used to keep African slaves and many slaves they suffer in here because no what? air, no, no, no light, fresh air, yeah, no lights. Yeah, so it was a very, very sad time. Yeah. Okay, so here is a cannon and then some crazy then the ocean views, so, aha, uh -huh. this used to be look out for the enemy. Yeah. What? So this was the watchtower. What? What? But this is original. Guys, this is an original Omani door, 300 years old. Oh, the paintings. Yeah, you okay. can see they paint the cross, the cattle, and their ships. Oh, this is, these are, how old are these paintings? Are these old paintings? Yeah. How old are they? This guy was uh, more than 400 years. More than 400 years old? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So guys, we're in the museum, and then there was a wreck excavation for the Portuguese ship. And what was found in that ship was this. So many plates, nice looking plates with good artwork. And are these earrings or something? Mm -hmm. And some really good looking plates here. So guys, this is like a treasure chest. They're using this to put like uh, gold, silver and all the valuables. Inside. Wow, inside. Yeah. And that's the Arab ground, they, they were using for the communication and ceremony. Uh -huh. and that's the original Portuguese church was made from India. Oh, it was made from India? Yeah. Okay. For the Portuguese captain. Oh, it was for the Portuguese captain. Yeah. So guys, this chairs for the Portuguese captain. And these are the drums? Arab drums. Arab drums. And what did you say about this chair? Guys, look at how beautiful this ship is. What? It's like a replica of how the sh Omani ships used to look like. This is Omani house, Oman house. Okay. So this is, I think one of some of the leaders or something. Yeah, these are the leaders like from way, way back. All right, let's see what else they got here. This is a traditional Omani man and the women 
what i love the way they rock all this gold you know it's crazy okay so guys you uh you've seen uh we've been in old town currently in for jesus you've seen all the things you can do while in old town you can uh walk the narrow streets you can take photos in front of the uh, Swahili carved doors. You can come to For Jesus. You can check out the local curio shops. As in, there's so much stuff to do. And yeah, and uh, guys, yeah, I've shown you guys all the amazing things to do. So make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, because we're going to check out some street food here in uh, Old Town and Mombasa in general. So guys, see you in the next video. Peace.